you know, I think it seems like when it comes to Deadpool 3, we all know that it's going to end up coming out this summer of 2024. But it's something about the Marvel Studios Japan decided to change the film synopsis. But for the most part, it's kind of questionable, and yet it does make sense about the Deadpool character. But I want to know how do you all feel about this because I don't want to say the F-bomb on here because I'm trying to keep my channel family friendly as possible. That effing irresponsible hero Deadpool will change the history of the MCU with Wolverine? With a question mark. So I'm going to read you one more time. That effing irresponsible hero Deadpool will change the history of the MCU with Wolverine. That effing irresponsible hero you call Deadpool. It's just that word alone makes you think you all know that Deadpool can be sometimes be irresponsible but the fact that you're gonna have him fight Wolverine and they're gonna end up having them team up together in some capacity but we all know how crazy Deadpool is gonna end up being but I think Wolverine is going to end up being the most anticipated character in the film because of Hugh Jackman. Debuting in the MCU with the iconic costume, more comic accurate. But the fact that Marvel Studios Japan decided to change the synopsis, calling him the effing irresponsible hero. I mean, it does kind of make sense because Deadpool is known to be very irresponsible most of the time in his career as a superhero and especially when he teamed up with the X-Men for the most part in the second film but I would be lying if I said that we wouldn't be getting any more surprises in this film because we all know that there's going to be some past Fox's universe the X-Men films debuting in the movie there have been teases like nods about past events but I'm turning it over to y'all. Like, what do you think about the change synopsis for the MCU? Like, like, give me your thoughts down below.